Hi, Michael Kern from the Ottawa Business Journal. We're here at the 2019 Bootstrap Awards. I'm joined by a pretty significant portion of the team of Pure Colo. Uh, Rainer, we're gonna start with you. And first of all, uh, a bootstrap. When I think bootstrap, I think young company. Yep. Rainer, you've been around, don't take this the wrong way. You've been around longer than most most companies. I've been around the block a few SHL times. SHL System House, yeah. Mitel, yeah. uh, Newbridge, iStar. iStar. We'll fill up the whole interview if we keep talking. <laughs> so. so anyway, we're talking about Rainer in wearing his Pure Colo hat. Right. So tell me, what is Pure Colo? Well, Pure Colo uh, is two parts. One is basically a specialized real estate company. It really is what it is, right? We basically get space and power, we give you that. The second part is my favorite description of it. It's really a daycare for computers. People bring the computers in, we feed them electricity, they pour we get rid of That's pretty cool. James, uh, you're part of a big part of the team, COO. Uh, operationally, this is, I didn't never really thought about it as a real estate company that, and a, and a babysitting ground for computers, but tell me from an operational point of view, how do you run Pure Cola? What's the, what's the vision there? So, so the vision was starting with this idea of instead of taking $10 million and going out and buying you know, data centers and making them you know, way too expensive, we were able to find a way of reusing uh, existing space and existing equipment and make, basically making a, you know, a data center more environmental friendly because we're reusing all the equipment. Uh, it, there's a lot of planning and design and engineering there to make sure that, that all the electrical systems are protected, all the cooling systems are protected, there's security and all sorts of brand new, uh, you know, really cool biometric things, but that's, uh, that's all part of that operational bubble is you know, reusing something, uh, reducing waste, making something green, become green. Wow, that's really neat. And Mike, you're wearing your business development hat today. Yes, eh? yes, absolutely. So I want to dig into, this sounds like a fantastic idea, very innovative in its, uh, in, a, in its approach. What's the market opportunity? Where Where is Pure Colo going from a revenue perspective? Well, it's huge. So from a data center perspective, you're looking at, right now we're consuming from the world population, about 5% of the world's energy is consumed in data centers right now. It's projected over the next five to 10 years to increase to about 20 to 25%. So that's a huge advantage for us in that industry. Then you take it a step further, and these guys have gifted me a little bit because the in, the area that we're in, Ottawa, is actually a monopoly market. It's all owned by Rogers right now. So because of that, we're actually the only option from a carrier neutral perspective. And that develops a really unique market for us because anyone who doesn't want to deal with a large corporation like that, that that has a lot of uh, headaches around how they operate day to day and things versus a nimble kind of smaller company like us, uh, we win every time. So it's it's a really great market opportunity. That's great, that's exciting. Rainer, we're gonna wrap it up with you and again, these are the bootstrap awards. So let's talk bootstrapping a little bit. How have you financed this thing? Well, we have one external finance source, but the rest is basically we have, we're, we've worked for free for quite a bit of time, like, like you normally do in bootstrap, right? So uh, in order to keep, our threshold low, we have to reuse and find inexpensive ways to do this. Free salary, and then a little bit of cash to make it all work. And from there, now we're basically running about break even. Tenley, congratulations on the 2019 uh, Bootstrap Awards, and thanks for sharing your story with us. Thank you. Thank you for having us.